This video will show you from start to finish how to use an aerator to improve drainage allowing air and nutrients to penetrate your lawn. Firstly we recommend that you give your lawn a good mow before you start. This is just going to make the job a lot easier for the aerator. Ensure you have a full tank of fuel before starting. Flick the switch on the handle to on. Push the fuel and choke switch towards the machine to turn them on. Pull the start cord then switch the grey choke switch off. Rev the engine with the silver throttle to make sure it's running smoothly. With large metal spikes stabbing the floor right next to your feet, it's probably a good idea to have steel toe cap boots on. Squeeze the lever trigger and push it down to engage the spikes into the soil. Press the safety switch and then squeeze the throttle to start the aerator moving forward. Now in most cases the spikes should automatically move the aerator for you, meaning you don't have to push it around. But if you're starting on a hill especially, you may need to give it a slight push just to get it going. When performing a turn, pull the lever up while the machine is still moving forward and this will unengage the spikes out of the ground. Turn the aerator around and then push the lever back down to continue the aeration process. Check the description if you want to hire an aerator. This process usually leaves quite a bit of mess on the lawn, so a quick rake will be required after you've finished aerating. Check out our video on how to scarify or how to mow your lawn.